Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Today OnePlus is rolling out a new update for their OnePlus 5 and 5D users, which is in the form of Open Beta. For OnePlus 5, it is Open Beta 17. For OnePlus 5D, it is Open Beta 15. And the update size is 193 MB for both the devices with the similar change logs. So as you can see, these are the changes what they have done under system. Under camera, they have added front portrait. Gaming mode updated to version 3.0. Weather application, they have done few optimizations. New UI has been added under Notes application and few UI changes under OnePlus Switch application. So guys, if you are running Open Beta 16 on your OnePlus 5, then you should receive an OTA update of 193 MB. If a device bootloader is unlocked, then you will receive a complete zip file that will be somewhere around 1.5 GB or 1.6 GB. So I've already received an update on my OnePlus 5. I'll download this update. Once the installation process is completed, I'll get back to you guys. So I've already updated my device and let's go to the software information. Under about section, here you can see Oxygen OS version is open beta 17. Android version is 8.1 with a security patch of 1st August 2018. And the build date is 29.8.2018. Directly moving on to the change logs under system update. And here you can see first one is the system which says updated Android security patch to August 2018 which I have already shown you. After that they say optimized background power consumption control. So hopefully after this update we should have a good battery life on OnePlus 5 and 5D. But for this you need to enable this feature inside battery section. Go to battery optimization. Tap these three dots advanced optimization and you need to enable advanced optimizations from here and sleep standby optimization. Then they have added toast message source for toast messages sent by background applications. So this is something like whenever you open any kind of application and you get a message on the screen. So this is completely related to that message, which we call it as toast message. After that added description about sleep standby optimization when the function is turned on for the first time. So I've already turned it on and when I turned it on for the first time, I did not get any kind of description here. Then they say fix call recording issues in India. So I normally don't record any calls. So I tap record calls, give permissions. And here you can see now recording is on. So let's disconnect the call. And it says recording is completed. Now you can find the recording here. So we already have recording available. So there is no issues with the call recording. After that, they have finally added front portrait for OnePlus 5 and 5T, which was a missing feature. So let's open up camera application, go to portrait mode and here, from here you can switch to front portrait or the front camera. And the portrait is not that great as you can see here. Hope further optimizations make it better. And then they have updated the gaming mode to 3.0. So that can be found here under settings, utilities and here you have the gaming mode in which everything is available like answer call via speaker. And this is a new thing what they have added how to show the notification. You can choose only text, you can choose head up or you can completely block the notifications. If you also want to lock the buttons, you can lock it from here. Gaming battery saver mode is also added. Disable automatic brightness and we have the same feature which was previously available on beta that is network boost. Moving on to the next change log which is related to the weather application which says hourly weather forecast then 8 units of meteorological data and improved data accuracy. So let's go to the weather application and here you can see now they have added few things like perceived temperature, pressure, visibility, tapping these three dots. Going to the settings, here we have the same things what were previously available. After that, they have updated the note application which says new oxygen UI optimized process for sharing notes as image. So let's open up note application. So this is new oxygen OS UI and if you want to share any text as an image, tap these three dots and share it as picture. After that, the last change log which is related to OnePlus switch application under which they have done UI optimizations, so nothing new has been added there. OnePlus switch can be found under utilities. This is the best way to transfer your data from one device to another. Now let's take a look at the benchmark results going with Geekbench application. In this single core scores 1950 wherein multi-core scores 6734. 
which is slightly higher than the previous update. Moving on to the Antutu Bench application. And here device scores 1,96,667, which is almost 7,000 higher than the previous update. So guys, these were the things available on this latest update. And if you have any kind of questions, you can let me know in the comment section below. And if you like my work, then do give me a thumbs up and also do not forget to subscribe the channel. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.